many students are coming back to me and then saying that they are not getting more calls for informatica and iacs so they prepare the resumes they upload it in job portals then they are saying that they are not getting calls see getting calls is purely based on various factor okay various factors it is not only that you have uploaded the resumes you will get calls right so we have lot of factors the first thing is your notice period so what is your notice period so immediate joiners will get more calls than we have 60 days or 90 days candidates because in the in the recent year rights we are seeing if you are offering the people has 90 days notice period and they are saying that they will join the project after some times they are not picking the calls they are not responding and they are not joining the project as well so we have commitment as a project team we have a commitment so we have to make them as a billable resource we have a commitment so in that case if we get immediate joiner then immediately we can get into the project right so that's the reason they will go they will prefer for immediate immediate joiner the project team and also the project team they will have the competitions okay it's different vendors will be there for the particular company then which vendor is giving the candidates quickly they will get more billability right more contracts so that's the reason the the project team always prefer for immediate joiners if it is a service based company they will take the people from their internal bench or they will go for the external hire also if they are going for external hire so they will prefer only immediate joiners they need immediately the candidates that's why we can go for immediate joiners okay you can ask me one questions i have 90 days notice period i am not getting calls so how can i so how can i get more calls how can i overcome the situation if you ask me so the thing is you can get okay you can you can apply more jobs and then you can get any one jobs at least uh, in the pipeline you can get it one job or if you have confident once you get one job you can put the paper and nearer to that one month one month period you can attend more interviews you can go into your dream jobs or you have to take the risk only but if you are taking risk make sure that you have complete knowledge on the concept like informatica iacs then sql project level so all this you have complete knowledge you should have the complete knowledge then you can take the risk you have more commitment and uh, you do not want to take risk then go for 90 days some companies they will prefer 90 days candidates you get the companies and then after that you go for your dream jobs okay and also getting the interview calls depends on the previous company you know right nowadays we are getting lot of fake candidates due to that they are looking for the previous company also okay service based company one service based company will look for another service based companies okay so how we will have the your previous the previous companies okay so which company you worked for and how many years you worked for so all this are comes into picture and your skill set so what is the skill set you are going to apply so whatever the resume you are preparing prepare your resumes with complete skill set based on the jd job descriptions you prepare your resumes you put all the skill set if if you are going for etl so you put etl data warehouse sql then plsql so if you need plsql yes plsql also you can use and you put the cloud you put informatica so all the keywords you have to use the skill set keywords and everything is important and your profile completeness your profile should be 100 percentage completed so if you go to any job portals now career or linkedin or any job portals you are going for so that job portals you have to make sure that your profile is 100 percentage completed and you have to verify your phone number you have to verify your email id as well so everything should be verified and skill set you tagged okay so they will say like a, some tagging right whatever the skill set you are making based on that they will bring more your your resumes will be on the top okay then your years of experience yes your years of experience more experienced candidate will get less calls in the intermediate experiences like 4 uh, years 5 years 2 years uh, up to 8 years 10 years right so they will get more calls so based on that okay so based on that you will get a calls but important role is your notice period 
so you put your resumes in that way the first first chance is we have to make sure that our resumes is pick, picked up by the talent acquisition team right nowadays we do have lot of ai tools even resume pick also we have the ai tools and resume preparations and the resume reviews and everything we have a lot of ai tools are available for example this is one of the ai tool we have skill sinker this is one of the tool so i referred this tool to many students so they follow the same steps and they said that they are getting more calls so whatever the requirement you are getting for example go to this one you create one new account okay for for you and go to new scan here okay resume over scan so left hand side you have to place your jd so what is the job requirement right hand side you have to put your resumes see here i will go to this particular resume okay resume number 2 or 3 whatever it may be you you prepare your resumes so go to this particular link and choose the resumes here it will upload so make sure that you are not uploading your personal details okay uh, remove your personal details and upload it and here left hand side you go to some job listing for example i want to search for iacs okay iacs developer so i will go to iacs developer here i will go to some job portals you can check so what is the requirement from the 5 days ago they asked this the, the capgemini and then infosys right so you can go to one particular job requirement so this way so you take four or five job requirement so you take this skill set right required skill set and the expectation so everything you can put it here and go to your skill sinker left hand side you place the required skill set for example i want to know informatica cloud security agent right intelligent cloud security agent power center and all this they need their expectation right so they are looking for intelligent cloud services power center excellent knowledge of informatica architecture strong sql knowledge performance tuning so whatever we have seen our in our project in our training so that is what they they are expecting so this is related to cai soap api rest api so those things will take our cai sessions so whatever we have here so you can upload your own skill set also etl then you can put data warehouse right can put data warehouse then agile methodology so whatever you want to add it here you can add your your own skill set also or you can take other one so then go for scanning just scan your resumes based on the requirement see here based on the requirement i'm getting score of 82 only 82 only so because some skill set i haven't mentioned in my resumes so if you have so you you do this way multiple job requirement you put your resumes in that way okay so some skills are missing data profiling is missing based on this job requirement jms this is related to ci ci only messaging and everything but here we have some skill set right ed etl soap api rest api informatica so something as missing something is not matching so this way you have to prepare then they will give you score okay so i need to improve my score here and i have to put my hard skills i have to improve right 68 percentage only so here what is the skill set here so if i am going to update my resume with these skill set then it will match 100 percentage okay so this way you have to scan your resumes you have to review your resumes manual review and some ai tool review so that you have to perform okay so after that so you take another example okay so here i will take another example here i'll go to this one job descriptions and responsibility and the technical skills right so you have the technical skills here so data analytics see that's what you have to put the resumes in that way okay so this way you have to use your skill set and go to this one so you put this one data analytics and informatica this one informatica intelligent cloud services and whatever the skill set you want so this one you want to make okay responsibility testing additional responsibility they are looking for but they haven't mentioned any key technical skills right so you can put everything so whatever you are looking for then scan it so check whether is a key skill set is matching or missing 
ఒక సిక్స్టీ వన్ ఓన్లీ సో వాట్ ఈస్ మిస్సింగ్ సో దే విల్ దీస్ దీస్ టెర్మినాలజీస్ ఆర్ మిస్సింగ్ ఓకే అజైల్ మెథడాలజీ ఐ హ్యావ్ ఇంట్ మెన్షన్ ఇన్ మై రెస్యూమ్స్ రైట్ సో డీబగ్గింగ్ ఐ హ్యావ్ టు పుట్ డీబగ్గింగ్ ఇన్ ఆల్ ఇన్ మై రెస్పాన్సిబిలిటీ ఓకే యాజ్ అ డెవలపర్ ఐ విల్ డీబగ్ ఇట్ సో దాట్ వీ హ్యావ్ టు పుట్ డిజైన్ డిజైన్ ప్రిన్సిపల్స్ దాట్ ప్రాజెక్ట్ లైఫ్ సైకిల్ క్వాలిటీ అష్యూరెన్స్ క్యూఏ ఎస్ ఐ విల్ వర్క్ విత్ క్వాలిటీ అష్యూరెన్స్ టీమ్ అండ్ యాజ్ పర్ ద క్వాలిటీ ప్రాసెస్ సో దోస్ థింగ్స్ యూ హ్యావ్ టు పుట్ సాఫ్ట్వేర్ క్వాలిటీ క్వాలిటీ అష్యూరెన్స్ టెస్టింగ్ టూల్ సో దీస్ థింగ్స్ ఆర్ మిస్సింగ్ సో యూ క్యాన్ అప్డేట్ యువర్ అష్యూమ్స్ యూ క్యాన్ చెక్ హియర్ వెదర్ ఇట్ ఈస్ మ్యాచింగ్ ఆర్ నాట్ మ్యాచింగ్ ఓకే సో వాట్ ఈస్ ద స్కిల్ సెట్ యూఆర్ గెటింగ్ సి హియర్ so there are see always you have opportunities hiring for gcp and iacs project in pune location right two days ago gcp etl iacs and this one they are looking for senior informatica iacs administrator so they are looking for administrator but we are the developer right tcs they are looking for iacs developer for four days ago if you go inside click on this and you can go here you can take the skill set right so you can take the skill set here and you can put it here okay so new scan you can put it your resumes put it here and scan it so how much score we are getting okay 83 so what is missing here the data architecture data quality data values insurance domain they are looking for insurance domain okay so we have to prepare resumes based on that so then it will be picked up by them they will consider you for the interview calls so this kind of work around you have to do it okay so work around you have to do and one more thing i want to prepare my resumes right so we have something like a resume trick so this is another ai tool you can go here you prepare your resumes build my resumes okay you can go here it's 100 percentage free only you can go here you put your personal info and professional summary experiences and your key skill set so everything you prepare and resumes it will build automatically and download it then after downloading your resumes say for example i want to put the skill set i want to go for okay informatica skill set right informatica iacs right so this way i have to go for informatica iacs and uh, informatica cloud so this skill set you have to make it informatica cloud etl right so etl this way i have to add more skill set more skill set then see here it will build so here itself so what is your level and everything left hand side right hand side at least you have to fill the details professional summary your name and everything so they will automatically create your resumes you can go for another template also you can choose a template so what is the way you need you can choose your template so you can fill all the details okay this this is the way i need this is the way i need okay i need this way so like this you can prepare i do not want the photo i do not want this way i i i have to prepare this way so you prepare your template you choose your template and based on that you create your your account and then you upload and this way you have to do some work around so in addition to this this some ai tools we have more ai tools also so nowadays they have the ats system right ats is nothing but application tracking system so they will use in the real time project okay for the resume pick so they will have the ata ats right so ats for resume uh, checker resume picker we can say in that way so they are using nowadays this kind of tools okay job scan so how they will use this way you can check it your resumes but don't put your personal details you can scan your resumes here see here 80 percentage match all this they will give so this way you can you can upload your resumes but while uploading you remove your personal details okay if you do not want to place your personal details here you just uh, remove your personal details and then you can put here job scan okay this is one of the website you can do this kind of uh, tools and prepare your resumes okay while uploading just remove your personal details and then you upload and put all the skill set if you are going for any job portals any job portals okay any job portals linkedin or now korea or any job portals you make sure that you are making all the sk- all the skill set for example if you are going for this this particular job profile right so mostly they will pick your resumes they will call you right 
definitely they will call you so here whatever we are mentioning okay power center informatica acs sql then notice period data quality data integration these skill set should be updated in your resumes see here another company right it's like they are looking for 11 days ago only they are looking for iacs developer so what is the skill set they are looking for you can take this one you can send them email right so they have given the email id here you can see this is one step we have to do ahead before calling okay so if they are if they are not calling we have to apply so we have to call them see here they have given the email id and phone number also you call them you send them the the uh, you put your email you can send your email your resumes to them and follow up with them and get it done okay so this is the way so there are openings are there for informatica and iacs everything right but we have to make sure that we are doing some homework to prepare our resumes then after getting the call you know how to how to explain your project right i already explained as part of our training so just to explain all this definitely you will get more calls if you have any questions always you can reach out to me so this link i will share it with you okay this link i will share it with you so just uh, you can prepare yourself